Good morning and happy Tuesday. Thanks for waking up with us here on KSNT News. It's my pleasure this morning to be joined by Dr. Jerry Farley, the president over at Washburn University. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for inviting me in, Brittany. Well, thank you for being here. Now, one of the top news stories, of course, out of Washburn is that racial slur that was making its way around oh, Snapchat yes. and uh, social media sites. The university had two different forums to discuss this. You hosted one of them. Right. What is the campus climate now? after all of those forums? I think campus climate has always been good, but there are things that we can do that will improve things. The problem that occurred occurred off campus and migrated into the campus, but that gave us the opportunity with one of those open forums to have people tell us what else they have seen. How do they feel on campus? What kind of problems have they encountered? And some students truly have had some unfortunate events occur that have made them feel uncomfortable. That's not Washburn. That's not what we want. That's not what we do. So we have reinvigorated some of our conversations, expanding it to the faculty and staff last week to find out what is on your mind. How can we make the environment better on campus? So we're spending a lot of time, a lot of effort to do that now. And were there any concerns from students about any racism on campus? You know, uh, that, that's difficult to answer because sometimes what we might as, as a Caucasian view as racism, they don't, and what we don't, they do. Yeah. And so we have to make certain that we're sensitive to what is being said, how we say it, microaggressions are things that we don't even think about. And then it, it creates an environment where a person doesn't feel comfortable. Well, I know a lot is going on right now for Washburn. Yeah. Commencement ceremonies coming up soon. We have award yeah. ceremonies. What's all going on right now that's, that's Well, been now good? It, it, it's time for students to get serious. <laughs> yes, uh, finals they, are coming they up. They have finals <laughs> coming up in less than a month. So yes. it's going to be an exciting time. It's always a rush to get to graduation ceremonies. But graduation is one of the highlights of the full year for me. Susan and I try to attend as many recognition ceremonies as we can on campus. And sometimes that means two of those an evening. Oh, but wow. it's good to, to, to see our students and to see them at their best and to recognize them. A lot of time we get, uh, we, we get a lot of publicity for athletes. And this time of the year we have a great opportunity to celebrate students and celebrate their achievements in the classroom. For example, our business school participates in a, a test that is given across the world to students and it's called a major field test. And for the umpteenth time in a row, we've, we have performed at about the 90th percentile wow. out of 500 schools across the world. And so that makes us feel really good. Absolutely. Also, just recently, our dance team, uh, the young ladies, they call them the Dancing Blues. Okay. And they won three national championships oh, wow. in three different fields. Uh, at a recent national uh, event. Incredible. And they come back and they're excited and oh. they, they, it is really it well, is We really are certainly fun. proud of all the athletes and students over Absolutely. at Washburn. Thank you so much for being here this morning. My and pleasure. Keeping us updated. We appreciate it.